Hey guys, I'm Scotty K. Alton with Terrier Vision, and we're out here at the first spring scrimmage of the Wofford football season. We got a chance to catch up with Coach Ayers and some of the players, and here's what they had to say. It, it was definitely springish. Uh, I was hoping for probably uh, 20 degrees less as far as temperature, but uh, we got the work in that we needed. Uh, we tried to be ultra conservative as far as the amount of hitting that we did. We wanted to make sure that uh, everybody stayed above the waist and, uh, you know, keep your hands off those guys in the red shirt. Uh, we, we've, uh, we've installed a lot. Uh, we've made some, uh, some real good progress with the young kids. And uh, we, we've got some older guys coming back that have played a lot of snaps. And what we're trying to do is give those guys minimal and uh, try to maximize the reps for the young kids. Rue, it's your fifth year. How is your body feeling after today's scrimmage? It's, you know, it definitely feels different. Feeling older, that's for sure. Um, so we got a lot to work on. Defense looking really good. They're looking sharp out there. Offense, we got a lot to work on. Um, we got a long ways to go. Coach Ayers, you got a couple coaches in some new roles. How is that working out? It's doing well. Doing extremely well. Uh, it's uh, it, it's no different than it was last year. I, I, I think you know the 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 approach, uh, the the way that we're uh, installing, the way that we're teaching is. Um, exactly like it was last year uh, I think the kids have responded and uh, you know last year we had some some young kids this year those young kids that uh, they know more and so that uh, I, I think we're, we're ahead of where we were last year from a defensive standpoint and uh, you know from an offensive standpoint there's a lot of uh, new guys that that we're plugging in but uh, overall, a lot, a lot of good things. JoJo, how was today's first spring scrimmage? Everything was good, you know, offense, they worked pretty well. Defense got to work on a little more execution, uh, but everything felt good. Felt good to like move a, a more in a low live sense, but just ready for the, the, the big game, the golden black game. And how important is it to get repetition between you and the quarterbacks during spring practice? It's been great. I mean, I've taken a lot of reps with Brandon over the years and getting more reps with Joe um, feels really good. You know, having to just kind of jump in last year towards the end of the playoffs was definitely uh, not an easy transition, but, you know, he's a great guy. He adapted well. He's a fantastic player. So getting more reps is definitely helping out with that. And what are some things from practice that translated over into today's scrimmage? Six practices in, I'd say we're doing pretty well. Uh, like I said, I mean, we've got to execute a little more and just put more things in, but I'd say for six practices, we're doing very good. Looking out there at the offensive line, there are a lot of new faces. How is the O-line performing? Yeah, I mean, losing, uh, you know, Anton and Daquan, definitely two big losses, but um, we got a lot of young guys who are, you know, working hard and, you know, trying to find their way. And, uh, you know, we're very hopeful, you know, things are meshing well. We got some, you know, great leaders coming back like Ross and uh, Duffy on the line. So, um, you know, we're very confident. Speaking of new faces, one in particular is the kicker. How is he doing? Well, he made all of his kicks. That, that's, that's a great start. And uh, Luke has the ability. The, the big thing is uh, what we've got to have out of him is, is just consistency. Uh, I'd, I'd much rather him, uh, you know, kick a 40-yard punt and uh, have a – four and a half uh, second hang time versus kick that uh, 28 yard shank and then the next one's a 68 yarder. Uh, trying to be consistent is the big thing in the kicking game. 